It is not your imagination. There are more electric vehicles on the roads. The U.S. Energy Secretary says in 2023, 1.4 million electric vehicles were sold, and that's 50 percent more than in 2022. So down the road, those vehicles are going to need service. And that means we're going to need more mechanics who can work on electric vehicles safely. That's exactly what the College of Lake County plans to do with a new half billion dollar grant to train more technicians. It's three, no? Or is it the front one? Lizbeth Mendoza is learning to fix cars at the College of Lake County. I like working with my hands rather than sitting at a desk writing, so I just like to keep myself busy. She's training on electric vehicles as well as conventional cars. So as fellow student and lab attendant, Daniel Lopez. I do want to be a technician, and I know the EV um, organization or area is like growing a lot quickly. You have to be cautious because Electric vehicles, after all, use a lot of voltage and can hurt you. Collision Department Chair Octavio Covasis says working on EVs can be dangerous if you're not trained properly. For example, we can't dry the paint like a regular car because of the batteries. We can't bring the batteries up to high temperatures. That's the kind of training CLC can now give to even more students. The school just got a half million dollar grant to expand EV learning. It increases our ability to have more students with more hands-on, with more equipment. Derek Kiesling is the service department chair. More training means more technicians who can work on electric vehicles, even in smaller independent repair shops. Currently, the only place people can really get training for it is through the manufacturer. So if you, you know, were a private individual, um, you know, you, you can't get access to this types of information. And that means more choices for EV owners and more opportunities for people like Mendoza and Lopez. EVs are like a different monster and you have to be catching up, otherwise you just stay behind. It's like a good challenge and it makes good money. The grant comes from the Illinois Community College Board.